Well, hey guys, it's Paul. Welcome again to the kitchen and welcome to cooking with the old guy with a little ASMR thrown in for good measure. Today I thought we'd have a little fun, do some sushi, but kind of a, a different combination than probably most people do. Let's jump right into it. Okay, so first thing we've got some green onion. And what I do is cut a bit off the top. We don't want that. And I cut a bit off of here and I save these roots because you can grow more onions. So what I want is just to have these and some usable strip lengths. Something like that. Now I've already got some sushi rice cooling off that I cooked. This is kind of brand I use. Okay, so for this, let's just cut off some strips. Something like that should be good. Now as far as nori goes, I found this on Amazon and it has a really good flavor. So I really like this stuff. Now you can decide if you want to use full sheets. I kind of favor the half sheets as far as for eating. I think it's easier. But it's easier to make the full sheets. And I should say I'm no sushi master. But the cool thing is you don't have to be. Because it can still be fun. And the key is you don't want your rice too thick, too thick of a layer. So you want to spread it out decently. And the key, if you can keep your fingers wet, really helps. And all we're going to do is flip it over. So we're going to have the rice on the outside. All right, now we got a peeled cucumber. I'm going to cut the ends off of. Going to cut it in roughly half. And then just get the seeds out of it. Just easy to do. People laugh on my YouTube channel and my cooking videos because I'm very slow with the knife, but that's okay. I still get all my digits, so I'm happy about that. So here we want to just cut little strips of cucumber. You can see what, kind of like julienne or something, I guess you'd say. Something like that makes a nice, nice size. Perfect crunch when you bite into the roll. Okay, so now we want to lay out our roll. And remember, on these low rolls, you can't pack too much in there, unfortunately. So this is some bacon that I, uh, leftover bacon from earlier. So, yeah, we just... Like a little bit of flavor. Okay, there's a strip of cream cheese and some cucumber. Now here I'm adding just a, a wee bit of, well, the way it's laid out, mayo and tuna. <laughs> Lots of meal. And we'll finish it off with a whole row of green onion. Okay, now that's a proper roll. Okay, so there's our mini roll. 
Now it's best to wet your knife so it cuts easy. And you can see, well, where's the camera? It's a pretty nice looking roll. Yeah, it makes a nice low roll. Okay, now for a drizzle kind of a sauce, I take some sriracha, some soy, I like the low sodium, and some balsamic or apple cider vinegar works good. Makes it nice. You get the crunch from the bacon and the cucumber. Low flavor of the tuna and the onions with the creamy cheese. Pure heaven. Well guys, thanks for watching and I hope you guys try it out. Get making some homemade sushi. Quick, easy, cheap. Till next time, we'll see you.